Thanks, Alyssa. We're not used to hearing about a Razorback win on a Saturday these days. For many fans, it's a welcome respite from a losing football season. Fox 24's Andrew Epperson joining us in studio. Andrew, you had some fun out with basketball fans today. How are they feeling about cheering for this winning team? Oh, great game. Just three games as coach. Eric Musman is just one win away from tying Chad Morris's two-year total at Arkansas. I'm not making that up. So understandably, this basketball season has an extra layer of excitement it might not have had during a winning football season. I talked to one dad who brought his son to today's basketball game and says it's fun to get a dub. Story feeling it, and Pearson is wide open. When one sport isn't really worth watching, Sills all the way to the bucket. Another steps in at just the right time. You can tell that Razorback fans are hungry for um, some wins and um, some um, good games to be cheering for. Nick Emerson and his son Cannon are Razorback fans through and through. Do you watch the Razorback football team? Yes. Are they very good? Not so much. So they're more than happy to let basketball heal the wounds caused by another bad football season. You can tell that. Um, they've been working hard this summer, and I think we should have a pretty successful uh, season, hopefully. Emerson says it's been hard to keep his son watching Razorback football since they've been so bad. It does. It makes it, it, makes it a little tough. But some fans think football will always be king, even if more fans might be excited about basketball right now. For this season, they will, but it's, it's just only one season. I think the football team will do a lot better next season. So even without Chad Morris, the Hogs haven't lost this young recruit. I like tackling, and so that's why I like football. Even if basketball might be a nice distraction. If you tackle, there, it's a foul. And and I don't, I don't, I don't like um, fouls. <laughs> Emerson says he wants his son to play basketball. He's just not sure if Cannon's going to grow up to be tall enough. I can relate, but maybe he can play point guard. In studio, Andrew Epperson, Fox 24 News. Thanks.